According to reliable official sources, grapevine trunk diseases, Utipa dieback, Esca and Black Dead Arm or BDA, are becoming increasingly apparent across the vineyards of Europe. Depending on climatic conditions, symptom expression varies from one year to another, but severe attacks, leading to considerable loss of vine stocks, have become more common. A recent survey of 700 European vine growers confirms this particularly worrying trend, with three quarters of them expressing concern, and depending upon the country, roughly 20 to 40 percent of the vine acreage affected. In affected vineyards, 5 to 15 percent of the vine stocks show symptoms. For Utipa dieback, new shoot growth is stunted in appearance with chlorotic leaves and woody parts show brown sections of necrosis. For the Esca BDA leaf stripe diseases, symptoms include intervenal discolorations followed by necrosis, then desiccation of the leaves. In severe cases, early and sometimes complete defoliation of shoots occurs, taking between a few hours and a few days. To differentiate between these two diseases, the characteristics of the wood infections are important. For Esca, a white, soft decay can be seen once the trunk is cut through. This rot is arranged in sectors or centrally. For BDA, dead tissue remains hard but is stained brown, as a dark strip visible from outside after removal of the bark. But caution is needed, as one disease can mask another and make the right disease identification really difficult. Indeed, the complex of pathogenic fungi responsible for these diseases often live together on the same vine stocks. Despite the fact that the diseases are now well known, their life cycles and mechanisms of infection still remain a mystery. As a consequence, defining the right strategy to provide effective protection is particularly difficult. However, in the absence of a solution, the presence of these pathogens inevitably leads to a weakening of the vine stocks, leading irreparably to their death. At the vine growers' level, the impact on profit is huge. Replacement of dead plants, additional labour costs, significant losses in both the quantity and quality of production. Vineyard losses are today estimated as lying between 400 and 800 euros per hectare per year, depending upon the country. At the retail level, the economic impact of grapevine trunk diseases is estimated at between 25 and 200 million euros per year, pointing towards a very worrying situation for the main European wine-producing countries. Taking this into account, it's absolutely crucial to break the deadlock. Expert advice is needed quickly, not only regarding prophylactic measures, but also to provide an overall strategy to ensure the future of the vineyards. In this matter and to this end, Bayer takes its responsibilities seriously and is working actively alongside its food chain partners. Bayer, science for a better life. La science pour une vie meilleure.